Hey yo guys, it's Gwen from Gwen Talks. And let's get this party started right with the dance off. So today I wanted to talk about the game that started it all for good gaming, Guild Wars 2. So in this episode of Gwen Talks, I'll give my opinion of Guild Wars 2 and what I've thought about the game through the amount of time I've played it. So just to give you a little bit of perspective, I've played this game since the initial launch of the game. I even played the beta before the game was released. So I've definitely been playing this game for quite some time now and uh... I've definitely seen all the changes that have come about and have raged about different patches and enjoyed other patches. So today, this is what I'm going to try to do is give you my overall opinion of Guild Wars 2, what my favorite things to do are, and some of my concerns or drawbacks for the game. For me, I truly, truly, truly enjoy playing this game. Like, I've really enjoyed this game since the moment it launched. It's definitely been one of those games where you can explore everything and everything feels like it has a purpose. Some of my favorite things that I've discovered through playing this game have honestly been the ties I've made with people and my guilds. My guilds have all been very, very interesting, and I, I definitely love them all. Uh, the next thing I love the most about this game is the ability to customize your character. Ca character customization is pretty important to me. I like to have my character look pretty amazing, I will say. I feel like I feel like my main, Gwen Okami, looks like the best person you'll ever meet. The customization in this game is honestly amazing. It's one of the biggest features drawing it to it. Another feature that I really, really enjoy about this game is the beautiful content. The beautiful maps, the beautiful splash art, just all the different details that go into making this game. This game has different options for all different types of people. If you're more of a solo player and you just want to sort of explore the world off it for yourself, you can do some PvE or player versus environment. If you like beating on uh, just other players throughout the game, there's PvP for you. So you can do some player versus player matches and try to refine your dueling skills. And then if you really just like getting in a big group and smashing people down, there's world versus world. So you can get you and your guild and other friends can get together and dominate another server. But one of my favorite things to do in this game, and probably my favorite game type, is Dungeons and Fractals. So Dungeons and Fractals are small instances where you can take up to five people with you and explore and defeat the bosses. Dungeons and Fractals have amazing loot chances and are by far some of the most rewarding things you'll do in the game. So now that I've talked about all the things that I enjoy about this game, here are some of the drawbacks I've had with this game. After playing through about one or two characters, this game lost lost its initial shock for me. Everything just sort of felt the same and it felt more like a grind rather than having fun. Another thing that really didn't uh, keep my attention in this game was the story. The lack of detail or concern for the story in the beginning really hurt the game as a whole. I will say that through the recent patches they have made quite an improvement to the story and the amount of work they put into it. But as an initial player from launch, it wasn't one of those things that really kept me in this game. Another thing that I really dislike about this game is the change of the community. When this game first came out, the community was super, super nice. Everyone was super helpful because no one knew what they were doing. But through the years, as it does happen with all other games, the community became more harsh, toxic, and troll. So for me, rather than having chats with strangers like I used to, now I'm sort of reserved to just talking to people I actually know or people in my guild. It's really hard to branch out there and talk to people when everything you're going to hear is pretty much a troll remark. And then finally, one of the biggest drawbacks for me in this game has been the lack of new content. So with this game, it's really fun to go through and play the new things that happen. But after that, once a patch has happened, you won't have another patch for a long time. And then with them making an expansion, they took out all the new content that they were adding, all the small little story additions, all the small little changes here and there, all the extra fun stuff like the Super Adventure Box. They took all that out and didn't really bother to do it because they're like, hey guys, we're working on the expansion. 
So the lack of content for me and a couple other players have been one of the biggest drawbacks. But overall, I really do enjoy this game. Though it may have a few drawbacks, it is still probably my favorite game of all times. So my question is, so would I recommend this game to a new person? Yes, it's a fun game. But the one thing I would tell them is there's a lack of steady new content. So guys, what is your opinion about Guild Wars 2? What are some of the things you enjoy doing? And what are some of the things that just start to irritate you in this game? Also guys, I have been seeing all those requests for games and I am working on them. So don't think your opinions aren't heard. I want to know what you guys want to see on this channel. It's not always about me, it's about you guys. So keep the ideas rolling. I love all these new games I'm getting to play and I love getting to share this experience with you. As always guys, may your days be good.